What y'all getting into? Yeah. Let them know. Introduce Hello. yourself. Hello, you know, I'm Swaggy Guy Juice. You follow me on Twitter. Y'all know. Another video. This video is called What Would You Do? Dot, dot, dot. See, I'm about to ask them two questions, but I'm going to answer the questions as well when they're done to see what they do in a certain situation. It's going to be some wild situations that they might never be in, but if they was in it, we want to see how a dark skin and a light skin would handle it. Two different perspectives. We're about to see. So, we'll introduce yourself. Champagne Hobby. <clears throat> Sleep. <laughs> okay, <clears throat> first question I got for y'all. What would you do if you were in a whole relationship and you walked in a room and your best friend was clapping? I got this. Go I'll be thinking about this. <laughs> what? <laughs> No, I've been thinking about this. Nah, because you gotta know what you're gonna do in situations when they come. All right, you know, all speak right. on it. First off, wait, whose room? Like, where? Where is this? What's the, what's the setting? Like, whose house? Her house or your house? Her house. All right, and I have a key, so I can just walk in there every day. Type shit. Yeah. All right. You live with her. Y'all got your own house together. It's in my bed. <laughs> yes. Yes. Damn. What do you mean? All right. Well, look. First off. I'll just leave the key on the table. That's their house. I'm cool. You just gonna once you gonna see them drop the key and leave? Yeah, because I, I don't want to. I don't. I don't need that in my life. I'm gonna take from here. I'm gonna beat that nigga ass. <laughs> Fuck her. That's a thought. I'm gonna beat that nigga's ass because you already know what it is. If that's my best friend, my nigga, like one. Oh, I forgot about that part. Yeah, that's your yeah. best friend. Yeah, yeah, yeah. If it's some, you know, some other like, random nigga, I'm not. So you gonna that. beat that nigga ass? He fully naked. <laughs> I have to have some. No, no, no. no, 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 no. That nigga be swinging no. at you. What? <laughs> 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 <He's> gay. <laughs> okay, so if we living together though, I definitely have a weapon in the house. Of some, either a bat, a, a gun, something, a knife. So something. you gonna shoot him? <laughs> I'm gonna do something to this You gonna shoot him? I'm gonna shoot my so best friend. So gonna be a dead naked nigga in your house. Not after long. I'm gonna, I'm gonna drag the body out, but you, so you. Grabbing on a naked nigga. Grabbing his dick and pulling him out. Hey, nobody said nothing about that. Hey. All right, in that situation, shit, I don't even know, bro. I re imagine really walk to the house and he really see. But here's the thing, though. Hey, that's the type of situation. I'm like, what the? F oh yeah, I had to. I bro, don't know, bro. Like, bro. I really don't know. And hey, that's the type of situation that, like, as soon as it happens, is when you know what you'll do. Yeah. Because I'm not one to talk about shit that I have to do like if i had to do that i have to beat that nigga ass but it, I, I don't know i might be having like a good day and i might just walk out and be like oh all right well i guess niggas and bitches hey just shit. just enjoy your shit just all right so next question what would y'all do if y'all walked home from a long day of work or school and your homeboy was smacking your mom how close is he like is he like your whole, like acquaintance or if you know somebody all right say if it's like you just acquaintances like you just injured like he just came over like you just, your mom just met him. But in situations kind of like, one of us, we not your best friend, but we cool with you type shit. But your mom never met us before. But like her I first time to, meeting him. I had to fight y'all. Yeah. I'll just put some clothes on and go outside. We so how are you gonna have a situation with your mom? <laughs> I'm, 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 I'm gonna move out. I'm moving out. Yeah, I'm moving out. Uh, Would well, you talk to her still? You a whole ass weirdo, hell no. <laughs> <laughs> <clears throat> I ain't got nothing to say to you. Yeah, for sure. I'm socking on that nigga first of all for disrespecting my mom. Not dis I can't even say disrespecting because <laughs> he's gonna disrespect my mom. Is she? <laughs> hey, but this nigga. She this nigga. I'm out. First of all, I'm out. Yeah, the fact that that's my mom. Yeah. You feel me? Okay. Yeah. And my mom. That's for sure. I'm my mom no more. I'm out the door. All right. So would you ever eat ass? I don't like how you whip. I don't like how that looks. <laughs> I ain't gonna lie, I'm not eating ass. <laughs> it's a big no for me. Married, not married, I don't, I don't care. You don't know, what if it may change? What if you really love the girl so much? If it's the girl of my dreams, I'm doing it. If Julia? Yeah, Julia Kelly. Look, if you need your ass, hey, you know where to come. Oh, that's nasty. Mud mouth. All right, what would you do if you were, like, went to a party with your girlfriend, right? And buff ass nigga just clapped her cheeks. He bigger than me? Boy, big. Awesome Kimbo Slice type shit. Oh. Uh, I'm a pusher. Keeper. 
<laughs> no, really, what would you do? For real, you had a party and she's like, she comes to you actually. Like, oh, this guy just smacked my butt. And you go over there on some horse. She's like, where he at? And she's like, it's him. <laughs> Uh, Hold on. That's Whatever girl bad. I date, she better not be stupid enough <laughs> to come back to me like that's him. <laughs> Bitch, you know how I look. I have to kill, bro, if I really have to do something. Like, and that's not even that serious to be killing somebody. Yeah, do no, you. That like, shit was fat, huh? I'm like, and that nigga, my keys too. We have to jump that nigga, actually. What are? If it's like multiple niggas with us. I have to jump them, but I, I personally not gonna win that. I'm All right, my strength. I got another question for them. What if you was getting in a fight and you hit the nigga as hard as y'all can and he don't move? I'm running. Give him a hug. What did you say, nigga? <laughs> Honestly. Get naked and he's not gonna fight you no more, though. Oh, true. But you just said you'll fight. That nigga, if he was fucking your girl, he naked. But I'm, but I'm not getting my ass beat, though. That's the problem. What if that nigga tackle you? If I'm naked? He's naked. <laughs> What? Who? Wait, wait. In what situation are we talking about? The nigga that's fucking your girl. Okay. Now I, I, now I really have to beat that nigga ass though, because I'm not, I'm not having dick on me. That's just out. So what would you do if a naked nigga tackled you? So like, <laughs> I'm not going to put myself in that position. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, that nigga would like, call the juke move ever. What if he juke and he just slap me? What would you do, bro? <laughs> what would you do if the girl said you were in a relationship, right? Well, you know black men don't cheat, of course. But let's just say you were cheating. Like, you, your side girl and your main girl. And you come home and, like, she, your, your girl told you before, like, she's inviting her friend over. And she come, you come home and it's your girl and the side. What would you do in that situation, like, as soon as you walk in the house and see both of them? And do they know that that... I'm like fucking on both of them. No, I'm gonna play it cool then. Yeah. <laughs> I'm gonna call the collective. Y'all some dogs. Oh, hey, what's your name? Oh, okay, cool. Well, are you gonna snitch on yourself? I'm not saying. At the end of the day, I'm respecting women, so all you gotta do is go on, beep, turn on that 2K, get in the party. Hey, y'all. Uh, I know you're gonna be like, nah. Hey. Imagine walking in, you'll probably be like, you will think you're in trouble though. Yeah. yeah. Oh no. Yeah. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Off tops. But if she is like, oh hey. And it's my friend, like, so-and-so, her ass really has no idea that you fucking her. So, I'm gonna play the dumb role, too. Be like, oh, hey, it was nice meeting you. What would you do if you went to your favorite artist's concert? They called you on stage, right? Like, out the crowd? Oh, yeah, yeah. And really just start flaming you. Like, really just on mic, like, everybody just laughing. Like, look at this busted-ass nigga. Like, I really mean, start... How you even brought me up on stage, nigga? You brought me up... What would you do? I, I'd beat Drake Cash right there on the stage. I'd get my ass fucked up, but nigga, that nigga, no, actually. You would not. I had to rush back on that nigga on stage. Well, he got the mic, though. I'm gonna take it. He's obviously right here. I'm gonna take it. He's gonna take the mic, security's gonna take you. Oh, well. i just take my shirt and I'll start flexing. So, you gotta do something. <laughs> I hate niggas like you every day. You can't. <laughs> just show the V line, so I'll find some way to make that nigga feel insecure. <laughs> so, what would you do? I know I'm shooting back. With no mic? No, I'm grabbing the mic in some way possible. <laughs> That's what I, I gotta grab the mic some way possible. I, I, he has the mic. It's right here. You try to snatch it, it's not going nowhere. I feel like without the mic, you just really gotta just sit there and look stupid. I'm like, I'm going on Twitter and telling a backstory. Yeah. Like, I'm going on Twitter right after it happened, like, everybody, like, why it's hot, like, trending. Mm. Look, I'm like, look, y'all know right that, nigga, uh, that nigga Drake gay. <laughs> I'm just, I'll just open up some shit that's gonna get him like They gonna think I know cause yeah. I was in that situation yeah. I, was, I was backstage, I seen Drake Doing some gay shit What would y'all do if y'all woke up Like you're laying on your pillow sideways And you seen a tarantula Crawling like right in your face Teleport Like for real I'm one of those niggas who freaks the fuck out Like yeah I'd be like, I will jump the fuck up and dig yeah. So you're not, what's, what's gonna happen after that So you're just not gonna move I'm gonna punch it out twice you know, throw away the whole I'm house. not touching it. I'm not, bro. I don't know what. All right, say you sleep in, you wake up and you see it on your arm. Hit it off. Yeah. You gotta hit it off. You can't just move. No, you gotta hit it oh, off. Oh, what if that shit land right in front of the door? 
Don't hop out the window, man. <laughs> Oh, oh that would be a C. What if his homies came in here? Like four. <laughs> oh yo. <laughs> a gang is in my room? <laughs> bro, what would you do though? There's no getting out. Uh, ooh. I don't fuck with spiders. Bro. I don't fuck with spiders. Keep the room. I'm not I'm not living in a house where four or five spiders tarantulas are in the house in my room. The fact that even though they could get into the house, I'm moving out the city, the state, the country, low key. Gotta be out because I don't just like. I can't step on the trenches. I feel like they're too big. Yeah. I'm gonna have to shoot that motherfucker or something. Here's what I think. Do they even squish? I don't know. I've never seen them being killed. Yeah. But like. You try to spray that shit with rays, it's gonna take the ray bottle and spray <laughs> it. It'll start jumping. Ugh. What would y'all do if y'all taking the shit and y'all seen the snake coming up between like the little hole? Dipping. <laughs> I don't give a fuck up. I'm in the in like mid push. I'm I'm like out. you see one really coming up right <laughs> under the hole. I don't I don't care. Run up the thing. Bloop. Oh my god, I should be on the floor. I do not care. I'm not. That's I'm naked. Not. I'm not gonna finish. <laughs> what would you do? Exactly what he did. Okay, that would be like, the scariest shit in the world. Like you see one coming looking at you. I you thought about that though, because shit. I've like seen other like videos of it happening. I'd be like, bro, that's crazy as shit. I'd be gone though. Yeah. Bro, what happened to me before is I was taking the shit and I seen like a weird black widow. So now every time I take a shit, bro, even no matter who else I'm at, you'll hear I flush the toilet first. Cause if somewhere yeah. on the rim, bro. <laughs> no, nah, for real, bro. Cause <laughs> I was taking the shit and I seen a, a spider come up from the thing. Gone, bro. And now every time it's like, I'm, as a kid, so now I be paranoid. Like, what like that? No white, no nothing. <laughs> <laughs> well, like, comment, subscribe. Let us know what y'all think. You feel me? We about to do another video soon. Tune in. I'm gonna put all their channels and all their information. And we out.